Hello and welcome. Thanks for clicking on the video. This is Nate, and we've got today the Hey Jude. That's right, this is part of the Tempo series from Clayton Homes. This one's going to be 1,896 square foot. It is a four bedroom or can be a five bedroom. It is two baths, so uh, we've got 28 foot wide, 72 foot long. Now the Tempo series doesn't have a lot of options in it, but is very well priced. And this is full tape and texture, but uh, you'll love what you see inside. You've got a dining room that's separate from the kitchen area, so it's not all blended together. You've got this really nice flex space just before you go into the utility room, which you could either use as a pantry or they've got it set up as a craft room. So lots of different options as far as that goes. Before we head on in, don't forget to hit that like button. Share this video with your friends and family. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button, all that good stuff. Now let's uh, head on in. Now as we come in and take a look at your living room area, I did forget to mention we have a den in the back of the home also. And I believe that is where your fifth bedroom is going to go. But in the four bedroom version, you get the den. So we're gonna head down this end. Now we've got this wall here. This is gonna be where your fridge is. As we head to the end of the home here, you're gonna start with the dining room. So our back door's over there. So it comes in from the kitchen area into the dining room, or you've got this area over here, which is the way we came. They do have the vents in the ceiling here. And we have the first of the four bedrooms. And I believe we're going to have walk-in closets in all of our closets. I didn't get a chance to look in all of them. Hello, Raiden. Cabinets below our sinks, nice little cubby for storage. Toilet areas right here on the uh, separated with a wall so you, you don't get that splash out of the toilet into your sink area. And behind us was the shower tub combo. We have the windows that tip in for cleaning, that, so obviously that one's going to open. So we can come down this way and we'll get the other bedrooms. 
So between your two bedrooms, you're going to have a storage closet, perfect for your vacuum and not that there's any carpet in here, but you're going to have your throw rugs and stuff like that, right? So here's some of the new upgrades that they have done to the Tempo series and still get them at a really affordable price. So this is coming out of Addison, Alabama, but you can see you can get the Tempo series over in Oregon, in case you guys are wondering where you guys can get these or where they're made at. These are all the different places that they're made, covering pretty much all of the U.S. You've got your walk-in closet once again. Once again, the walk-in closet. Now here is some of your cabinet and countertop options. So as I said, they don't have a ton of options and that's how they can help keep these homes a little more affordable. Your floor plan options that you can get, we're in the Hey Jude. You got the Rocket Man, Brown Eyed Girl, Lovely Day, Shout, Let It Be. That was at the uh, Louisville Home Show. Of course, we are at the 2024 Biloxi Home Show. So, our back door. like a storage closet here, but this would be the closet in the fifth bedroom. It's going to be a basic closet here. And so we will come this way since we came the other way. This is going to come into your kitchen area. We have frigid air stainless steel appliances. So you have one stack of drawers there. Now they are some extra wide drawers, so you've got more drawer space than what you would normally have. And these are the eight and a half foot ceilings. Kind of, they call it your pantry area around your fridge, but you can always turn this flex space back here into the pantry. So 
So this would be that flex space with your attic access. Now, like I said, they've got it set up as like an arts and crafts room. And if you're in an area that's got high humidity, they have a drain so you can plug in a dehumidifier in here and kind of help uh, keep some of the humidity out of your home, make it a little more comfortable. We've got our furnace. Now this is part of their E-Series. So you've got the digital panel on the water here. There's an app that you can use to access that. You can log into uh, Clayton's website and find out all kinds of information about that E-Series. So we come into the primary bedroom, we've got some people in here, so we're going to skip over right into the bathroom. And so as we come back to this side of the bathroom, we have our water closet area. Now it's not technically a closet, but uh, it is kind of separated off. You could put yourself some storage shelves here, do something with that area, set up a vanity. <laughs> and then this is new to the Tempo series. So this is a marbled style, solid surface stone. Now it's not marble, but it looks like it. I thought it was acrylic at first, and then I was talking with the representative and he said it is an actual stone. So this is a new option in the Tempo series. It doesn't come standard, but this is one of the few options that you can now get. Cubby area back here where you can set your laundry baskets or maybe set your vanity up right there even. So now we gotta look at the primary bedroom. closet is over here. Now as you can see with the way the door is, there's not a lot of room to put dressers, things like that on the walls because you got your door that takes up a lot of space there. But there is room to put a dresser in the closet. Still got plenty of room on each side to access your clothes. Plenty of room to walk in. And you guys can walk down there to that comment section and let me know what you think of the Tempo series, especially some of these nice little upgrades that they've included. And while you're there, don't forget to hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, turn on notifications, share this video with your friends and family, and I will be back shortly with some price information. So what did y'all think of the Hey Jude? So before we get into price information, though, some of y'all might have had the, the keen ear there and noticed that the song didn't quite sound exactly right because I did a drop pitch on it by 1.5 just so I could hopefully get around the YouTube copyright issues because I thought it would only be fitting to use Hey Jude is the song for the Hey Jude, right? <laughs> anyway, hopefully I don't get a copyright strike out of it. Let me know what y'all think because <laughs> I got Rocket Man and I got Freebird and I was thinking of kind of doing the same thing with it. So let me know what you think. Is it kind of corny or should I do it anyway?
So now before we get to price information on the home, remember that uh, at 5.30 Mountain Time, I upload a video on Sunday, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So four times a week, you get uh, new videos coming out. And uh, I was just actually looking because I'm going to be working with the company here probably here shortly. And I was just looking at how many videos that I have already. I have 581 videos. So there's a ton of videos to go back and watch, you know. Of course, I, we're not doing that yet. <laughs> but uh, there's a lot of videos to go back and watch. And I'd be willing to bet you that 500 of those are different homes. Of those 81, so to say, there are some of the same homes filmed at different times in different locations with different options. So, of course, you know, not every dealer is going to order the home exactly the same. So when I do come across a home that is one I've previously filmed, if it's got different options, I'll film it and show it to you guys. Okay, so now we're going to get this price information on this home. Now, this one was built in Addison, Alabama. As I stated in the video, the pricing information I'm giving you is for the one built in Hermiston, Oregon. Because normally on these home show videos, I can only give you an estimated retail price. In this case, the homeboys there in Spokane have this home listed on their website at a starting price of $171,000. Now I will link to both Clayton and I will link to Homeboys when I put this video up so you can see what it might be in other areas versus what Homeboys has it listed for as a starting price. Now the only difference is the one at the Homeboys is 1,920 square foot whereas this one was 1,896 square foot. So it's slightly larger so you know that could affect the overall starting price of the home now don't forget to check out the home show videos over here or this super nice clayton home that i filmed and i will see you in the next one thanks for watching bye